guys, welcome back to another episode of Fran Bo. We are on our way to talk to Mountain Cotrum. So we're gonna come up here and we're gonna talk to him. Ah, who dares to wake me up? Who? I'm, um, oh my goodness, you're alive. I'm sorry to bother you, sir. I'm Fran. Fran, I see. I don't know what that means. It's just my name. Oh, all right, mine is Coltrum. Do you want to know why? Yeah, sure. Coltrum means born in heaven. I used to be a star. And because I was born in space, it's very logical. Oh, wow, I've never met a star in person. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you too, friend. So what brings you here? Um, well, the great wizard told me to get the hat. So if you don't mind, hmm, I can't do that. I'm divorced. Okay. What do you mean divorce? I just need the hat, sir. It's very important. I can't. If I give you the hat, the entire land will suffer. Okay. You'll have to find another way to get home. The king told me that there's no other way. Please help me. I told you, I can't. My wife left me. She was the one covering my top. If I take off the hat, my magnum will can erupt and kill everyone, including you. Uh, where is your wife now? Maybe I can make her come back. She, she decided that it was time for her to start her own island. So sh she broke up with me, but I didn't get the chance to ask her why. I miss her so much. Um, well, so, so now she is her own island? Do you know where she is? I think she's on the water. Otherwise, I would very strongly feel her presence. But I don't. My love, my beloved wife. I'll go and see if I can find her, alright? Then you give me the hat. Only if she comes back. Otherwise, you know what can happen. Can't I put something else on top of your head? Like a rock or something? No, I like this hat. All right, I'll be right back. So we are gonna go. <gasps> oh, I know you're all alone. Let me be your mom. Let me feed you. Come to my side. And you will have many new friends to play with. I, I don't want you as my mom. You look very scary and I don't like you. Fran, who are you talking to? Uh, the the woman standing it's it's nothing kitty yeah mm -hmm. I'm gonna switch to this I'm gonna go in the water I'm gonna talk to his wife hello miss wake up I have a message for you oh hello a messenger what a good day Yes, miss, I'm the messenger of love. Love? Oh, but you're not pink. Should I be pink? I used to have human skin, though. It's almost pink. And does the messen messenger of love have something to share? Of course, I'm here in the name of love to bring you back to your husband. No, he made me very sad. Nobody has the right to make me sad. Um, I understand, but what did he do to you? He was so hot, and I fell in love with that. But lately, he was cold and boring, so I felt left aside. I cried so many times. He used to grow a beautiful red flower just for me, to show his love for me. But this year, nothing came up, and you know what? I am the one protecting him all the time, so I want some credit for that. But, miss, if I find that flower for you, would you come back? I guess, but I have no hope. Besides, I'm the ruler of my own island now. I'll go and see if I can find the red flower. Do you know where it grows? always at the bottom so it's, it's very different from all other flowers the bottom of what my husband's bottom of course bring it to me and I shall return to him good because guess what I have here's your flower <laughs> miss I found it look look the red flower oh thank you so much it looks so beautiful you are indeed a great messenger of love thank you miss we should go back to your husband right away he really misses you I'll see you there in winter time all right back to the mountain this is going so much quicker. <laughs> All right, go back. Uh, back. Up. Up the mountain. Hee <laughs> hee, it's very nice to see you two together. Now I would like to have the hat, please. Thank you so much. I'll never forget what you've done for us. Come on, my adult, and climb on to the top. Oh, cute. And here's the hat. Thank you again. Yes, we got the fucking hat. Okay, we're gonna come down. Oh, wow, thank you, sir. I have to go and give the hat to the great wizard now. Bye. 
All right, uh, here's your, wait. Here's your hat. Here's your hat, sir. Oh, my hat. I feel the knowledge flowing through my body. I feel happy. That's great, sir. What's next? The gift from the soil, the fruit. The creation of selective random elements so we can eat. Beautiful, isn't it? Yes, it's incredible. Yes, the fruit is talking to me now. It says that the book, my book of knowledge, it's in the library, but beware. The book may be hiding, so you have to be persistent and patient. Good, sir. I'll go to the library then. Wait, there's a password you'll need to get inside. Let me think. Think, it must be something about how we learn, or... Ah, I remember the password is... Your basic senses are easily manipulated. Shut them down before learning. Okay, I'll remember that. I'll go now. We're gonna go to the library. No, not there. Down. To the side. Then we go down. Then we go up. Then we go in. It's the twins! Do you remember, friend? You're a murderer. You are a nutty little girl. Nutty girls must be punished. Do as I say. Do as I do, friend. Jump. I didn't want to kill them. I didn't want to. Oh, my dear. Don't listen to those evil things. You're strong. Let them out of your head, my dear. Am I crazy, kitty? Tell me. No, my dear. You just have to be strong. Don't let them play with your head. Oh, my kitty. I feel completely broken. My chest hurts. Oh, my dear. I'm here for you. Don't cry. I love you so much. I love you too, my dear. We should keep them going. Or we should keep on going now. Go. Let's go to the library. Okay. Stop right there. Do you have the password? Yes, I do. Yes? All right, what's the password? Let me remember the words. It was something like, your eyes and ears are limited sensors. Shut them down before learning. Mm, good. And why is that? Because then we can see. It's like the city. The knowledge is everywhere, even in darkness and silence. You can come inside. Have fun. Yes! so great I have to turn the lever now why don't you do that um do that you have to do it multiple times oh scared the fuck out of me <laughs> I already knew it was gonna happen and it's so scary Get the book. That's not creepy at all. Hey, right, we got the book. So that means if thirsty creatures know about him, they do indeed. Alright. Here. We're gonna go here. And we're gonna go back up the mountain. Back up the mountain. In the winter time, went too far. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Hey, I got you your book now. <sighs> Here's your book. It was inside the musical box. I saw the doll. The Edward lock. That sounds like fun. Thank you for the book. This certainly makes me remember many things. Many, many things. And now what? There are two things left of the star. Yes, fish in the water. Fish, fish swimming free. Go back, little fish. Go back home. Wow, sir, you woke up the fish. Yes, because I remembered how to do it. Isn't it beautiful? That's magical, sir. Can you do that with other beings, like humans? Of course, but only if the circumstances are positive. 
but the circumstances are often not positive. I see, sir. Hmm. So we need to find the missing stones, yes? The fish told me that my shoes are on the feet of the amazing dancer. Do you know where this dancer could be? Um, I do know. I'll go and see. All right. So we're gonna come down here. It is... No, 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 wrong way. Hmm, okay. It's not this way, oh god. Ah, jeez. Ah, oh, jeez, Rick. Wait. Why am I so confused right now? Oh, it's right. Oh, Karen. Right, there we go. Well, there was a hole behind the firewood. Splendid. Come on, kitty, go inside and remember, I need a ticket to get in too. So maybe you can take somebody else's. But I don't want to steal. We'll just borrow it, kitty. We can give it back later, alright? Alright. Q. So we're gonna come in here and we're gonna change it up to a different time. I see a ticket. I can't take it right now. There we go. Got the ticket. And I wonder. Oh, here we go. I have the ticket. I have it. You're incredible, Kitty. I love you so much. Okay, we're gonna come over here. We're gonna go here. We're gonna um. No. Oh no. Uh, combine with this. Yes. We have a ticket because he won't take the the one. Yeah, I did. I found it. Use. Look, sir, I think this is my own ticket. Hmm, I see, but you suddenly drew it yourself. I thought it was the right thing to do. I wasn't invited, so I invited myself. Very clever, little lady. Well, I guess I can I can let you go in. Enjoy the show. Thanks. Alright, uh, we're gonna give this ticket back to you. Um, here's your ticket, miss. I'm sorry, but I took it and I wanted to give it back. Oh, goodness, you're very <gasps> nice. Thank you very much. You're welcome. All right, um, so now the thing is... You have to... No. Oh, God. I forgot. You got... You can't... Um... You can't let it turn to winter, because... It exits you out. Um... Alright, so you have to come in here. And you have to mess with this. <laughs> oh, fuck me. It makes him dance really fast. Okay, give me the shoes. Thanks, okay, bye. I'm gonna leave now. I have stuff to do. Um, no, these. Use these. Sir, sir, I have the shoes. They're very pretty. Look. Whoa, you did it. You really have an extraordinary machine inside your head. Thank you, sir. Now let's do the last one until I can go home. The last one. Air. Hmm, I recognize this feather belongs to the laundress. Yes, I saw him very injured. Maybe yeah, he'll be fine. He has the pink water. That can fix everything. Yes, that's true. Well, what do we do with the feather? Go visit the old Malacca's mechanical doll. My wand will be there. I have to finish my rabbit science. I think I have the answer. Well, okay, sir. I'll bring your wand back. Okay. So, I think it's... One, two, two, three. 
um, one, one, two, two. Ah! Okay, great, we got the damn wand. Now we can go. This is happening so much quicker, Muse. Here's your wand, sir. Oh, magnificent, splendid, you did it. Really, but where are the stones? Can I borrow them? I can't lend you the stones. The stones are very, very special. What I can do is place the stones on locks of the door, but you, you're the only one who could turn the key and actually open the door. Oh, I see, the king told me that he would show me where the door is. Ah, then we should go and talk with him, don't you think? Hmm, wait, I suspect that you can't return home looking like a tree. I almost forgot, yeah, you're right. Can you bring my human body back? Yes, I can. This is exciting. I haven't done this in hundreds of years. Let's make a human, yes? Give me your clothing. I need to smell it. Let me smell this. This could work. We will make a human. Oh, this is so exciting and mildly creepy. Good. Now I'll go to the center of the Star of a Thirsta. And think about your body, your head, your leg, your other leg. And your arm, both of them. Now concentrate. My dog is staring at me. <laughs> Randomly selected elements. Find your path to your true essence. Become Fran, the human, now. Is it done? Oh wow, thank you so much, sir. You really are a great wizard. Yes, that's my name, Great Wizard, because of the greatness. Hmm, I think we have to go to the king now, so he can show me the door. I'll be right there. I have to finish something. I'll be there. Now go now. Okay, we're gonna go. Nope, wrong way. We gotta go down. Down. Here. Up through the way. And we made it! Oh, I guess we gotta actually talk to the king. Everything is fine. It feels like heaven. W what are you? Leave Mr. Midnight alone. Is your head playing with you again? Can't you see yourself in the mirror? I'm not you! I'm not! Let Mr. Midnight go now! We'll, we can, we will, oh my god, we killed the traitors, because that's what he is, Fran, don't you see? My kid, he's not a traitor, he promised me to be by my side, he promised. As your mom and dad did, who promised to take good care of you? Wake up, Fran, you're surrounded by traitors. Leave me alone, leave my friend alone. I'm the only one you have, Fran, I'm the one who's always by your side. Now let's get rid of this traitor, eh? What do you say? Let's be happy. Let's be so very, very happy together. Go away! It wasn't me! Oh man, poor Fran. Fran, what's wrong? Why are you crying? I'm crazy, sir. I'm totally crazy. The doctors are right. But you're not crazy. I'm very sorry that you feel that way. You should be happy now. You found the stones, you became human again. That's very great indeed. My dear, let me wipe those tears. I don't want to hurt you, my dear, and I feel like I'm about to do it at any moment. You won't. I know that because you love me. Yes, Kitty, I do love you very much. Fran, remember what I told you. If you love, you're alive. And that is the only thing that matters. You will always find the power to fight those monsters in you. Now let's go and open the gate so you can go home. Yes, let's do this. Let's go home. <laughs> Here we are. Yes, but where is the door? Oh, right. I have to make it visible. But are you sure you want to go back? I'm sure, sir. All right, here we go. The human must leave. Open the secret door into her reality. Let the human return home. Oh, wow. You're, we're going home, kitty. Ah, Zia, the king. Good day to you. I brought the stone so this lovely creature can go home. Thank you, sir. I'm very nervous. It'll be strange to be far away from you all. They don't leave. I can make you a place to stay. A very magical place. Wizard, she has to leave. 
I have received a message from one of the Valakas, and she is not ready. Oh, I see. What are you talking about? Ready for what? Come on, wizard, place the stones. We have no time to lose. But ready for what? You know what the Valakas told you about facing your truth? Oh, uh, yes, I think I remember. Well, should I? Yes, go ahead, wizard, sir. Magic stones, create the lock that only the human can break. Oh, man, okay. Let's see if I remember how to do this. Well, now, it's time for Fran to be the key. You are the only one who can open this now. Oh, wow, all right, let's see. Again! You did it, Fran! You can go home now! I'm so excited! Oh, I wish I could leave you something so you can remember me! We won't forget you! You're a very special creature! Oh, I almost forgot! Polan just gave me this for you! Oh, thank you! Tell Polan that I wish I could help him with his wounds! I gave my aid patches to a girl in the hospital! But anyway, I'll tell him, and don't worry, Polan is better now! Oh, oh! Before you go, you must know! Before you return to your reality, you will go through the secret woods. The woods are a kind of invisible passage between our realities. And you may encounter terrible creatures that want to eat you. But just run, they're quite slow. And you're telling me this now? That sounds very scary. Don't worry, you'll do fine. I hope so. Well, Mr. Midnight, say goodbye, let's go now. Goodbye, gentlemen, I had a great time. I, I like you very much, goodbye. Oh. Gonna get it, gonna get it. I died like a good like 10 times on that first jump. So, at least you guys get to miss that. <laughs> Although it was kind of entertaining. Chapter 4, Part 1, My Imaginary Friend ah! My goodness, the door opened, wow! Come on, Mr. Midnight, let's find out where we are! Ah, bye, door! Oh, Fran, I hope we can find home soon, I'm starving! Mr. Midnight, look! I think we're at the other side of the bridge. Do you remember? The one we tried to cross before we fell into a Thursda? Yes, I remember. Great! Let's keep going, Kitty. We have to be careful now. And that is going to be the end of this episode of Fran Bo. Um, if you liked it, leave a like down below. Maybe even a comment to let me know what you think about it. And I hope to see you guys the next time that I play anything at all. Bye!